Hello, this is Anita Manjirata. We'll discuss some examples on data validation today. So this is my table. It has product ID and the name of sales fan, first name and last name. One sent XYZ135 sold by Abhinav Kumar. XYZ135 sold by Abhinav Kumar again, ABC200 by Abhinav Kohli, so and so on and so forth. So I need to create a data validation list for these product IDs. So for that, I need to create a list for laptop, desktop, TV, refrigerator. So this is all I need. So I should name uh, my header as product. And then I need to create a list for this range. So let me select this range. Then I go to data tab. Under data tools, I found data validation. So clicking on it, this dialog box appears. On settings, I need to create a list. Right? And this, on the source, I need drop down list for laptop, desktop, TV, refrigerator, Okay, so yeah, now I can see a drop down list here. So I can select here whatever I want. So I need refrigerator here, here I need TV, here I need laptop, and so on. Now I want mobile also to be added in this list, suppose. So can I add mobile here? Let's see. So it says this value doesn't match the data validation restrictions defined for this cell. So I cannot do it. Right? So what should I do? So first of all, let us clear this what we have done on data validation dialog box. Let's clear it. So I press clear all. Okay. And then this drop down box. This drop down arrow disappears, right? So let me undo it. So for adding mobile to this option, I have created another column named product and then I've added laptop, desktop, TV, refrigerator here, not added mobile here. Okay, I'll add it later on. So first, let me see that whether we can do it by adding a new column here so let me create a data validation again for this range so i've selected this range i went to data validation dialog box appears i want to create a list under source i need to select this range right this range which i have created just now see this is absolute reference because this list is my fixed list, I click OK and then a dialog box, a uh, drop down arrow again appears. I can select whatever I want. Laptop again. So, this is how I can do it. Okay. Now I want to add mobile to this list. Can I add it? Yes. But mobile has to be added in between these lines, not below, not at the end. So I can add mobile here, right clicking, I go to insert, then I say shift cells down. This column appears, mind it, it is not appearing here, okay. So here I can add mobile, it automatically added to my drop down menu, see mobile is here. So this is how I can add any other product in between the lines. Okay. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for listening. Bye-bye.